My mother did Neil Simon's Barefoot in the Park on Broadway. She had turned down the role of the mother originally because she was hesitant about working with this unknown director by the name of Mike Nichols. <laughs> Wonder what ever happened to him. And during the run of Barefoot in the Park, a fan who owned a sporting goods store came backstage one night, and knowing that she had three boys, he gave her three sets of metal baseball cleats in varying sizes. Well, she thought this was kind of a peculiar gift, but thanked him nonetheless. So a few weeks later, I was sitting at home, watching TV, minding my own business, when my brother Philip came in. You have to move. I want to watch F Troop. No, I was here first, and I'm watching Bugs Bunny. It's the one with the purple monster. Well, he saw one of those metal baseball fleets lying around, and he picked it up, and he whacked me in the back of the head with it. <laughs> my mother was in the kitchen doing dishes and saw the whole thing. Now, for you parents, you know those times that you see your child do something so rotten, you just want to strangle them? Well, I was screaming bloody murder. So once Mom came into the room and made sure that I was okay, she started chasing Philip all around the room. But he was so little and squirrely that she couldn't catch him. Finally, she got him pinned behind the living room sofa, and she started kicking in his direction. Now, she knew she wasn't kicking him. But she was so angry, she was just kicking in his direction. And she said, just wait till your father gets home, young man. You're going to be grounded for a month and no TV. Well, once the heat of the moment had subsided, she said to herself, well, that was pretty crummy behavior. Being a good Catholic girl, I guess I better get my butt to confession. <laughs> now, all of the Catholics on Broadway knew that if you went to St. Malachy's on 49th Street, the little old priest there loved theater people. And he'd give you absolution and get you in and out in 10 minutes. <laughs> so after a matinee performance of Barefoot in the Park, she ate a quick dinner in her dressing room, put her hair up in curlers for the evening show, wrapped a shocking pink scarf around her curlered head, slipped on a white mink coat, and in full stage makeup, she trotted off to confession. <laughs> While she was sitting there saying her rosary and waiting to go into the confessional, she saw the old priest that she knew and liked come out of the confessional, and she saw this young 20-something Irish priest go in. <laughs> Bless me, Father, for I have sinned. It has been three weeks since my last confession. Father, I kicked my child. And this young priest glared at her through the grate in the confessional. And he took a good long look at her. You kicked your child. Yes, Father, I kicked my child. Are you a working girl? <laughs> Well, yes, Father, I work. What part of town do you work in? <laughs> well, mostly around Times Square. <laughs> and what hours do you work? <laughs> well, primarily in the evenings. <laughs> oh, and who takes care of your children while you're working evenings? Well, my husband does. Oh, and your husband approves of your work now, does he? <laughs> well, not really, but I love it so much he knows he can't stop me. <laughs> and you kicked your child. Ah, uh, Father, is this going to go on much longer? I've got to get back to work. What exactly is it that you do? Well, I'm an actress, Father. What did you think? Well, what show are you in? Barefoot in the park, Father. Good God, you're going to be late for the evening show. Say one Hail Mary and get the hell out of here. 